Prince Harry's decision not to privately visit Queen after Philip's death sparks U.S. rage. Prince Harry was condemned for not visiting the Queen privately before or after the death of Prince Philip, a U.S. columnist has claimed. Harry and Meghan Markle have had a busy past few months launching their post-royal careers. They are also grappling with a flood of publicity after starring in a string of interviews. In each, they spoke candidly of their time with the firm, several times accusing the family of things like failing to help Meghan with her mental health struggles and racism against their newborn, Archie. These allegations came during their talk with US star Oprah Winfrey, who is known to be a close friend of the couple. The timing of the interview, and the others that followed, could not have been worse. A month after the interview aired, Harry's grandfather, Prince Philip, sadly passed away. Throwing his schedule upside down, Harry made arrangements to fly to the UK to attend the funeral that took place on April 17. Despite having made the journey in the face of a number of coronavirus restrictions, many have remained highly critical of the royals' handling of the death. Particularly in the US, where some commentators were enraged. Maureen Callahan, writing in the New York Post, condemned Harry after she claimed he had not privately visited the Queen during the time of mourning. She wrote, Harry, once the Queen's favorite grandchild, never visited with her privately before or after the recent burial of her husband, Prince Philip. Whether he asked and was denied or never even tried, the public perception is the same. Harry's relationship with the Queen, once so close, has been grievously harmed by his and Meghan's repeated public betrayals. It was initially unclear if Harry would be able to make the long journey from California to the UK. At the time, travelers from the US were required to quarantine for two weeks. With Philip's death on April 7 and his funeral just 10 days later, on normal grounds Harry would have been unable to make the funeral.